The Judas Prophecy by Alan Trustman. A thriller in the Da Vinci Code genre, but much more readable. Would make a much better movie. A novelized screenplay by the screenwriter of the movie classics, The Thomas Crown Affair, Bullet, and They Call Me Mr. Tibbs. New York, New York. A wonderful town. A pretty young paralegal is knifed in the back by a killer described as Middle Eastern as she enters the subway in the morning. Seattle, Washington. A pretty young wife is knifed in the back by a killer described as Middle Eastern as she leaves a Mariners game with her husband. NYPD Special Victims Detective Sarah, cousin of the first victim, discovers that both women were six weeks pregnant and both were patients of the same New York obstetrician. Why? An Italian obstetrician has published a paper claiming it is possible to implant third-person DNA in an early gestation fetus. Sarah travels to Rome to meet her former boyfriend, Detective Marco Salvi. She no sooner arrives when a pretty young pregnant Italian wife is similarly murdered in the Piazza Navona. And another pretty young pregnant wife is murdered in Bologna. Why? The trail leads to the Vatican, and then to the Zealot Museum in Jerusalem. Are the Zealots trying to kill all pregnant women who have received the procedure because someone has implanted in some pregnant woman the DNA of Jesus Christ? The trail leads to Saudi Arabia, Turkey, Monaco, and finally, Miami Beach, back in the United States. A thriller raising a fascinating science and theology question, says eminent Catholic theologian John T. Noonan, Jr., senior judge of the U.S. Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. Available from Amazon, Barnes & Noble, and Ex Libris. <laughs>